While everyone is celebrating 4th of July with fireworks and family, it's important to remember the furry members of the family. A lot of them hate the 4th of July. They it can do. be scary. And Twin States reporter Emily Erickson takes us to a local vet's office for some tips. In keeping pets safe from the sounds of fireworks on 4th of July, Dr. Moore of Meridian Animal Care Center says security is key. Keep them at home, keep them inside. If you have a crate, I would recommend putting them inside a crate uh, just so that they don't tear up blinds, bust through windows, those type things. If not, the other thing that you can do is put them in a small room. Another way, she says, is simply by playing with them. <laughs> if you're home during the fireworks, go ahead and play with them. Try and do the, the balls, um, toys that they have, throw them around. And if you need medication, you need to see your veterinarian because some of these animals, it just stresses them out. And we do have medications that we can put them on that'll just kind of help them sleep through the whole procedure. <laughs> animals are not raised around those types of um, episodes. And so when that happens, all of a sudden, it's just completely out of their norm and they're not used to that. And because of that, they retreat into a fearful mode. Dr. Moore is a major advocate for microchipping and says it's a great <laughs> way to locate animals who have disappeared appeared during July 4th or at any other time. At Meridian Animal Care Center, Emily Erickson, Twin States News.